John, you asked an, uh, a very important question. This is John Woodall. You asked a question, so important, an important yeah. question before we got started. So I, I'm coming from CBN News right here. They're saying that stress and anxiety and a lot of anger is what we're seeing right now within the United States. And one of the, the things I really want to ask you is how much does what we intake, our diet, affect the way we uh, mentally and emotionally respond to stressful situations? Uh, so much. You know, I use the phrase, you, you are what you eat. It's not just your physical body. Right. It's your emotional body. It's your spiritual body. Right. It's very hard to be spiritually in tune when your body's out of tune. Mm -hmm. You're focused on that, and you're ruminating on your health and how bad you feel, etc. You So, uh, but, you know, there, it, whether it be anxiety, depression, uh, dementia, all of those things are tied into your, your nutrient intake in your brain and your body. It's so key to how you feel physically, yes. emotionally, spiritually, intellectually. Uh, it yes. is so key. Absolutely. If we really understood, I, I use the phrase, uh, most of us are operating on four cylinders and have no idea we were built with eight because wow, we're giving ourselves such poor fuel to operate on. And once you get, you feel uh, and give your body yes. what it needs and feel that, it, it's an amazing experience. It is amazing. Absolutely. Listen, that's why the mission of this ministry is to get you prepared in every, you know, almost every category that we just mentioned, because in the last days, the spiritual warfare attacks you not only emotionally, physically and listen there's a there's a spirit of death in, in in the nation there's a spirit of death all over the world right now with this pandemic if i share with you what happened to my mother that morning or yeah that morning before she got released it will shock you because the spiritual battle in order to deliver a prophetic word for this season is so the enemy doesn't want the prophets to be here to warn you and several of the prophets, including Emma Stark and Cindy Jacobs, have said that this ministry is the only ministry, the only one that is building a platform for the voice of the prophets to be heard worldwide. Amen. Wow. Wow.